that you've worked hard, you know you've done everything you can, but you also realize, like you said, Al Del Greco's the kicker, and that you're well within his his range of uh, high probability, and that uh, that's something that really can uh, can get to you mentally at this point in the game. Time permitting, following this game, we will be switching you to Foxborough for the conclusion of the Dolphins and Patriots. The score here in Seattle tied at 16. Al Del Greco already has three field goals. And warming up on the sidelines for a potential game winner. Third down and short. Eddie George trying to pick up the first down, and he may be short again. Boy, here they, comes Del Greco. They really, I don't think that they wanted too much to worry about picking up the first down. They were just going to get in there, let him kick the ball. With no, yeah, it would have been nice it. to get out a little closer. Exactly. Right? <laughs> yeah, well, true. But Although, with, no, with no timeouts, I mean, they basically have the 40 seconds left to get the, kick, the, the field goal team on the field, get them lined up, let them concentrate, and boot it. And the clock continues to roll. Here's a look at what Del Greco has done. 23 of 26 this season. This a potential game winner from 37. Number 90, Terry Wood. It's okay, we're getting it for number 99. Michael McCrary gets through. Not only does he get through, not only does he knife through, there's 99, Michael McCrary. Not only does he knife through, block the field goal, recover the field goal. Right there. But he has the presence of mind to realize that I'm not going to make it. Robert Blackman in yards. <laughs> Michael McCrary. What a huge play on what appeared to be a game-winning automatic field goal for Del Greco. Turns into a McCrary right. block and he's a got McCrary lateral to Blackman for the distance. And look, he's got the ball. He's taking her home. One more time, you're going to see McCrary obviously come in to the right side of your screen. You talk about the ball bouncing the right way. They say that footballs take funny bounces. Not, not, not for the Seattle Seahawks the last two weeks. Todd Peterson, who was watching in agony on the sidelines earlier, thinking that his 23-yard field goal would cost his team the game sees that Blackman is going the distance and he's off the hook. I can sleep tonight. Vindication. <laughs> and, but look, he had the presence of mind to know that he's got to go get his helmet to go kick the extra point. <laughs> good, good for him. In the excitement, you thought he would have maybe forgot about that. And that's what it feels like to go from what you think is going to be a loss to four seconds away from a victory. Have, have these Houston Oilers just suffered at the hands of things like this? The one, the, the one point loss against the Chiefs? The one point loss last week, last to, week to the 49ers? Now let me tell you what they're going to do. They're going to take that football, give it to the equipment guy, he takes it to a special guy who can paint it up real nice and say Michael McCrary, Block field goal for a touchdown, won the game.